ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've all been waiting for, another Supreme unboxing. By now you know I cannot stop myself from buying so much Supreme that it makes me sick to my stomach and my wallet sick to itself, um, you know, because I'm a broke boy. You know, we out here spending three, four hundred bucks a week. Just kidding. Uh, last week we spent like 60. It's not that bad. But I do spend a lot and it will not stop. My, uh, my 10 items per season limit has been exceeded um, incredibly fast. And by incredibly fast, I mean like week one. Um, but, you know, a lot of stuff I'm buying, I'm keeping. Um, I gave away the hat, the Supreme Cause hat, uh, to one of my friends. Because I know he likes Supreme Cause and he wears hats like that where I can't. Um, and so, you know, figured he would be able to use it a lot better than I can. I wear a lot of the shirts that I buy. Um, you know, and I, you know, I use the stuff I buy. It's not like I buy it just to sell it and I lose money on it or anything like that. You know, I got the stuff, I use it, and so it, to me it's worth the investment I put into it. Um, but today we got a couple items from Supreme Week 7, 6, 7, I don't know, it was the Clayton Patterson week, whatever week that was, um, that's the week that we're going to go over today. I do have one item from that collection and then two items from the week previous to that. Um, so we'll go over that, obviously, and then we'll kind of go over next week a little bit. And to tell you guys, or not next week, this week, which is the um, the spring tease week, and I'll go over kind of what I'm going going for on that, you know, that drop. Um, but we'll start off with the stickers per use. They like to screw me real hard. Uh, so I got two normal box logos. I think this makes like 500 that I have. Um, it's ridiculous. I can show you the stack I keep just in my room. I have like another stack that's bigger than this um, in my suitcase. But hey, if you want to go vote, you're more than welcome to go vote with a lot of these. But I mean, that's just, I mean, look at that. Let me add these to the the thickness. Mm. Logo king though right here, boys. If thumbnails could just take themselves, right? But, um, yeah, it, it, you know, I wasn't expecting much. I'm hoping with the spring tees next week that I get all of those stickers. There's a couple stickers that I will say that I would like to get more than others. But like I said, we'll save that for when I talk about what I'm grabbing from next week. Um, let's get into what I got from this week. Yeah. Um, first off, we're going to start with the two things that aren't from the Clayton Patterson week. They're from the week prior. Um, if you paid attention to anything that week, you would know the big item, or not the big item, but like the hype item from that week were the Supreme Wheaties. So we got a box of those. Uh, we got the purple camouflage. Um, as you can see, it says Wheaties. You got the Supreme Box logo on there. Wheaties, you got the little Supreme Box logo down there. Same thing on top. And then you do have you know, all the stuff on top. The Breakfast of Champions when it expires, which is December 16, 2021. So you can eat this if you'd like. It's still good. Um, I wasn't going to get these. But then I saw they were still sitting on the website. They were six bucks a piece. I knew I was getting something else, and so I added them on there because it was like, why not? You know, um, I didn't stop there. I got the yellow camo one as well. Um, so it's basically the exact same thing, just yellow camo. Still got the small box logo, the big box logo, nutrition facts. This one expires December 16, 2021, as well. And yeah, just kind of like a cool little accessory. I'm just gonna put them in my accessory case. Um, just to have them. I was really hoping I could have gotten them from like a retail store. So like, I know Walmart, I think was supposed to be getting these. I was really hoping I could get them from Walmart because they would have been like $3, $2, something cheap. But I'll take six bucks a piece. I'll take them because I basically, you couldn't even really tell that I bought them because I bought, you know, something else from that week that kind of covered the cost, um, of shipping and stuff like that. Um, but finally, last but not least, for sure, from the Clayton Patterson drop, itself I was able to grab one of the hats um, I was able to grab the bone hat the blue and red colorway of it as you can see like last week I opened it already because I wanted to try it on to see if it fit um, this one I am going to keep um, thankfully as you can see you got the little I don't know if you guys care about that kind of stuff but it just shows you that it's the skulls five panel um, and the royal one size fits all it is one of those hats once again that is the um it's not snapback, but it's, um, I don't even know what you call this, like a button, 
button thing. Um, but I think this one fits me a little bit better. As you can see, I think this one fits, you know, a little bit better. I actually like the way it looks. The other one just kind of looked weird. This one I think actually works. Um, I really like this bone embroidery on it. This, this whole hat's really sick. It's all just embroidered. I'm not going to turn around like an idiot, but you guys can see all the embroidery. It says Supreme on that one, NC on that one, or NYC on that one. Um, you got the one with the other skulls in it. You got the one with the X in it, and you got the front one that says Supreme. And like I said, you got that nice embroidery um, of bone, but it's kind of like a heart, too. Really nice. Um, really, really solid hat. Probably going to wear the crap out of this, to be honest. I think this is going to be one of my favorite hats going into summertime, uh, just because it looks absolutely insane with that embroidery. Bye. Uh, one little, I don't know, funny detail, cool detail, I don't know what you want to call it, silly detail. I don't know why this is in here. It's like a little mesh panel that um, is just attached to the front, and it kind of just sits inside the hat. I don't know if it's to keep it, um, keep the front of this kind of up. So it doesn't like collapse on itself so you wouldn't be able to see this because like if the panel wasn't there this might collapse in on itself and you wouldn't be able to see i don't know if that's what the point of the panel is in there um but it's it's there it's not you, can't, you don't notice it because it's, it's in front of the bill but it's just an interesting kind of note i don't i don't know feature i don't know what you want to say here's what it looks like backwards might work a little bit better better as a backwards hat to be honest yeah i think it does but who knows? I'll probably wear it both ways, just how I feel um, during the day that I'm wearing it. But that's what I was able to get from the Clayton Patterson week from Supreme. Um, really happy with this purchase. I knew as soon as I saw this hat, I was like, I've got to get this hat. This hat is absolutely sick. I love, if you've watched my channel for a while, you know I love embroidery. All over embroidery. Cannot go wrong with that. So, yeah, that's all I got from that week. Um, now we're going to kind of make this a little bit longer of a video by talking about what's coming out. This week, when this video comes out, that same day, um, it's the spring tea week, so you can kind of get ga gander or gather from that uh, what week I'm talking about. I'll be going for a couple of things. Um, there is a few t-shirts that I want. I want the Anna Nicole Smith t-shirt. I want the Apes t-shirt. I want the Bear tee. And then I'm, I'm kind of in between on the, um, I don't know what they call it, the Jordan tee, the Dunk tee, where he's flying through the air and you got the dolphin in the background because the guy that did that artwork I believe did the artwork for the sailboat tee as well which that was one of my favorite tees from that season uh, I unfortunately bought it and it was just giant on me and I've never gotten around to buying it again I need to buy it again because I thought it was one of the best shirts from that season um, but yeah that's what I'm thinking about getting from those uh, there's also a bandana duffel that I would really like to grab um, in the red colorway so I can have that for you know future trips so I can put stuff in it carry it with me I do have like side bag versions of it. I'm not a big side bag guy or a bag guy in general, so I think I'm just gonna skip on the bag. And then there is a t a pin that's coming out of the bear tee, um, and I'm also gonna try to grab uh, for my collection. It's kind of to display it because I don't really put my pins anywhere, but I do display them in my case that's right in front of me. Obviously, you guys can't see it, but I can. Um, yeah, that's kind of my general plan for tomorrow. Um, it's just, or today, I guess is what I should say because you're watching this video or yesterday or two weeks ago, whenever you're watching this video, is to go for some of that stuff. Um, I know one of my friends, the one I gave the hat to, wants the bear tee as well and the bear pin. So it's going to be a little bit of a challenge to try to grab his stuff as well as my stuff. But I think I can do it. The Anna Nicole Smith and the cream, I think, is the highest like voted, most hyped item. And then it kind of goes to a different couple of different things that I wouldn't even think about grabbing. Um, so hopefully I can get everything I, I think I can. And then hopefully I can get a couple stickers. You know, like Anna Nicole Smith sticker would be cool. The Bear sticker would be cool. A couple different stickers. That's not freaking box logos would be sick. Um, just because I would really like to, you know, add a little bit to my sticker collection that I have that I put on my suitcase when I travel. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much my goal, my plan for tomorrow. Um, tomorrow also marks the re-release of the Off-White Converse. So I will try to go for those as well. Hopefully we can hit on those because that's just a good pair of beaters for me. Um, I don't really like Chuck Taylors that much. They're not comfortable, but I wear the crap out of those just to beat them up. So we'll see. Hopefully tomorrow goes well. And then I'm sure there's 50 million shoe releases. I know the the UNC Hyper Royals, whatever you want to call them, are coming out soon. I know there's some, I'm sure there's a Yeezy at some point in the next month. 
there's a bunch of stuff. We'll, we will get there when we get there. Um, if you like today's video, though, go and drop a like on it. I would appreciate it. It would mean a lot. It helps me uh, find a bigger audience to watch my videos, help me grow so I can get more content like this out to you guys. Um, comment, what do you think about this Clayton Patterson collaboration? Do you think it was a good collaboration? Do you think it was kind of fell flat a little bit for you? Go and let me know in the comment section below. Um, also, what are you guys going to cop tomorrow for the spring tees? Um, you know, drop. You guys going to cop anything? Let me know in the comment section below. I do read all those and I do reply to all of them. And subscribe if you haven't ready to stay up to date on everything I do upload. Like I said, we got some more Supreme coming. Hopefully I hit on the Converse. And then there's always there's always new stuff flowing in. Or if it's not flowing in, I can always just make some new stuff like spring outfits, summer outfits. Um, some of my clothes, maybe. There's a bunch of stuff I can do. So there will not be a shortage of content. I can promise that. Sorry we took a week break. I just kind of hit like 40 million things. And then I didn't hit anything for a week. And I didn't really want to spin anything. So we just kind of skipped a week. But we're back, and we're going to keep making content so y'all can enjoy watching some good stuff. Um, I appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you for all the support recently. It means the world to me. And until next time, peace out.